Hi, this is Artifacts of Mars, and there is a strange anomaly. What you're looking at here is Mars' the South Pole. That's the uh, South Polar Ice Cap. I want to show you something. We're going to zoom in. I call this Golden Nugget Anomaly. Now look at this thing. It stands out. Uh, just unbelievably. Now, uh, it's also very bright on one side. Now, if you're on, if you can stand on Mars and you're looking at the sun, uh, the sun wouldn't come from that angle because you're at the pole. The sun would go. Sun would always be directly north. This is the South Pole, and so the sun's direction. Let's see if I can get the drawing tool out. The sun's direction. It curved a little bit, but it would always be like that. It would always be. That would be the direction of the sun. But this thing is bright on this side. Which means we have a mystery. It's, it's the same way on Earth. If you're standing if you were to stand at North Pole, I'm assuming you could, you would be looking at you would be looking south. The sun would always be south, and what it would appear to do is go around in circles every day, and of course it would either get lower or higher depending on whether it was uh, spring or summer. That's what it appeared to do. It would, instead of going down, it would go around in a circle. Okay. So I call that, I call this a golden nugget anomaly. I was actually looking for something else. There's supposed to be a massive hole somewhere here, and I haven't found it. Nobody seems to want to uh, leave the coordinates so you can find it. So, two questions here. Why is it bright on this side when the sun... should be coming at it from a much different di direction. The sun should be coming at it from the direction I showed you. Towards the uh, South Pole. Because it's right near the South Pole. Instead, we have the bright area in a to totally different direction than you would expect. Sorry, but physics are physics. So there's one mystery. The other mystery is, why is this golden? And I don't have an answer for this. Now, I don't see any evidence of artificiality. But on the other hand, we got a genuine mystery as to why this is golden. Is it a huge uh, sulfur deposit on Mars, or a huge gold deposit, <laughs> I don't know. You know, looking at this, it could be that the uh, sun is coming out from the right direction, as you're seeing the top of this, so let's take a look down. I'm going to adjust the camera and see what we can find here. This is all being ad-libbed. This is the first time I've looked at it like this. Okay, maybe a patch of... Uh, I... 
maybe Patches of Ice, with sun glistening off him, possibly. It doesn't explain the yellow color. Okay. No, nope, direction of north is straight down from our perspective here. I don't know. You now, looking at this and zooming in, I would say we're probably, I'm going to go on a limb and say we're probably seeing some type of vegetation here. That's what it looks like, to be honest. Of course, it doesn't explain the bright area, and there's a small dot right here in this bright area. Uh, I'd say this is some kind of vegetation. Perhaps of a highly unusual kind, I don't know. What I'm seeing is the fuzziness and such that you would normally expect to be associated with vegetation. Why is it yellow in color? Well, depending on when this, uh, particular picture was taken, it might be that it started sprouting and hadn't got enough sunlight yet that it would be anything but yellow. Or it could be the sunlight's a little strong for it. Because if you have a plant where it's not getting any sunlight, it's growing in the dark, it turns yellow, right? Because you're uh, basically starving it. it the uh, green chlorophyll can't really exist because it doesn't have any light. It's biology 101, but uh, you, a plant has to have light. And that's how they make food. That's how they make the energy that we eat, eat when we uh, eat our food. Biology 101, I shouldn't have to tell anybody this. Okay? So, my current thinking is... What we have here is a stand of vegetation. Maybe it's in bloom, too. There's just no way to tell. I can try to get a little closer here and look it up. This one's as strange as they get. They said nothing artificial that I can really tell, but possibly a patch. Evans would suggest vegetation, possibly in bloom. Unbelievable. And here's a definite patch of vegetation. Well, there you have it. I'm not going to spend all day on this. Uh, I would say definitely there's a definite possibility we're seeing vegetation. And with a highly unusual kind. So, uh, don't get out your, uh, uh, gold collecting equipment or anything right yet, because I don't think it's actually gold. 
That's not what it's looking like to me. I see the fuzziness. That'll do it for today. It's our Facts of Mars, and... Here's another little patch of it. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching. Remember, you are not being told the truth about Mars. I will not back down on that statement. Thanks for watching.